Hi guys, welcome back to this channel. It's Max from the Max Creation, always giving you the updates whatever happening in the Gulf and definitely what you need to know. Either in with something maybe in between, we definitely have to talk about it. Let's talk about the UAE. Someone asked me about the question of the UAE and that is regarding what we call the visa extension. Remember, when we are looking at 2020, there's a lot of things happen. Definitely you'll agree with me. People who are in UAE, you will definitely agree. A lot of things happen. We have a lot of deportations coming in and a lot of changes. New visas, new visa systems or new visa changes come into the country. And that is definitely when we can sum up and round up the year of 2022. To some people, it has been an easy year. To some people it has been a very difficult year because the most people the people that lost their jobs the people that he deported the people that lost uh, uh, lost the the opportunities and lost where they will they will definitely get bread to feed their families in one way or the other but definitely in life we definitely do understand such kind of things coming in uh, in one in and one and you definitely know what you need to understand is that uh, perseverance is the best people we never have to give up every single day but we need to keep on trying we need to keep on trying going harder and harder we push harder we are talking about what we call the visa extension in the UAE which is something that we need definitely to understand or some some bit of key aspects that you need to understand for example if you are planning to go to the uae uh, dubai shirija and other emirates of dubai other emirates of uae and if you are planning to go there something that you need to understand remember as of 13th of december 2022 extension of the uh, of the u uh, of the visa visa in the uae was not permissible it was not allowed that is when it started that they closed off the uh extension of the visa visa if you are in a uae and what does it mean that uh why is it this like this remember when we had what you call the pandemic uh the the uh, coronavirus pandemic we, we remember at that time that for you you would renew what you call a visa visa while you are in the uae which was quite very easy for people in the uae who just uh, uh you just extend your, your visa visa and you continue with it but remember this has been amended what was the added advantage they are extending during the pandemic that you, you knew or extend your visa visa is that you had a lot of time to do and a lot of opportunities for you to do whatever to do the other part of the problem with that in the pandemic uh, renewing extending your visa within is that most of the employer at that time took advantages of people who are with the visa visas People you are people who are in the UAE, Dubai, Sharjah, and other other Emirates. You can agree with me that during the pandemic period, most of the employer took advantages of people with the visa visa, either by giving you or giving you jobs that you're not supposed to do, or by even giving you the jobs but they do not pay you, or give you a smaller a smaller amount of salary that was was uh, even against what 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 the government had speculated, or what the government uh, encourages employers to pay. So that's where that's where the the disadvantage part of it all came in. But remember, when we are looking at uh, the new system, what is the advantage of the new system of you? of the government itself of refusing the visa extension of the visa visa extension within the UAE it is a, it is going to avoid those people who have been bypassing the system to make other people cry so that is definitely that what you have to talk, to talk about so it means that it means that there you have two options when it comes to visa, visa, visa expiring, if you are in the UAE, you have one option, either to exit and go back to your home country, where you got a visa from, either from the recruitment agencies, then they can renew the visa for you. Or you have another option that if you are in the UAE, Dubai, Sharjah, and other Emirates that make up the UAE, you can still change your visa visa to what we call a residence visa that will be the only choices the only opportunities that you will have at your glance so however this is going to help you it's helping people to stop what you call abusing the system 
So those people that definitely, if you are in the UAE already and your visa is nearing exp uh, expiration date, those are the options that you have. Either to change your visa, visa as fast as possible to residence visa by either getting employment or getting someone to employ you, then he will change your visa status. Or you exiting the country, going to back to your country, get a new visa exp ex extension, then you can come back in the UAE. But remember that is also going to be a double impact on you because it will involve charges. It will involve a flight coming in, coming in, which is definitely going to be a subcharge on you. But those are options that they have on glass. So remember, those are the only choices that you do have for you to change or to stay, to still be permissible to stay in the UAE. Remember before, we also had a situation whereby you do what you call airport to airport. Uh, for example, there are people, if you got your visa on arrival at the airport, that is what we call airport to airport, and you feel it is nearing expansion because you cannot renew it from, the, from, from within the country. So you definitely can go to the airport, you renew to the nearest airport, then you re-enter the country again using the nearest, uh, the nearest airport at a time. Hope I've tried to share up something for you for people who are in the UAE for the person who asked that question. You have two choices. Either to exit to go back to your home country where you got the visas from, either it's from the recruitment agencies or from what you call the travel agency, then you re-enter the country. Or you have the, the you have the, the chance to renew you to, to change your visa visa status within UAE to what you call a residence visa. A residence visa by definitely getting what you call employment, someone employing you and uh, giving you a job, then definitely they will have to change that visa for you. Thank you so much for coming back to the channel. It's Mix from the MX Creation, always giving you this latest update. See you again in the next video.